y'all sometimes right i have this best mom ever moment and that ha, just happened today Ooh, good morning guys it's actually very late in the week today's wednesday um yeah struggle <laughs> i really would like love to be like cute for you guys and stuff but this is what i really look like in uniform if you are just finding my channel first time being here my name is renee i am sergeant james i am a 68 whiskey a medic in the u.s army been in the army officially seven years uh march 18th that was my seven year anniversary with the army. I love it. And on this channel, uh, it's all about going after and getting your goals. Those are pretty much the sit down videos, but I do do a lot of day in life, weekend in life types of videos because I want you guys to see what it's really like, right? To be in the military. I want you guys to be able to see behind the scenes. And uh, Dylan had a baseball game on Monday. Oh, oh shit. today is thursday it's thursday today uh so i wanted to come on and talk about quarter two goals i know everything looks crazy right now i know and i want to let me wipe y'all off a little bit right this front camera uh i wanted to talk to you guys about quarter two goals so first quarter is done 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 um i think i did okay right First quarter is always dedicated to my kids. My kids are back to back to back when it comes to their birthdays. So I highly focus on that. Like birthdays are like a huge thing for me. I don't do any trips. I don't do anything but the kids' birthdays on like they're all March and the beginning of April. So for quarter two, my focus is to just continue my journey with um, my finances and paying things off. But in that, like quality of life, right? So there's some people who they don't eat out like at all, like at all, at all. Like every penny, they do zero balance budgets and every penny goes towards a bill or a payment. And I'm just... I'm not about that life. Like, I am about quality of life. So, yes, I do love how life has been going as far as paying off debt and getting a better financial situation. But I am huge when it comes to quality of life and um, just enjoying the life that I'm given. So, I'm not going to put every... Like, right now, I'm in the Popeye's line, right? Why? Because my husband's working crazy hard right now. I'm finishing orders because one of the kids' birthday parties is this weekend. And... I ain't trying to eat no salad today. I've been eating salad all week, right? So I'm in Popeye's line. If I was doing like a zero balance thing, I just wouldn't. Now, I don't really go shopping and, and do all the things I used to do. Um, but yeah, I'm about quality of life, guys. So for quarter two, my goal is that is to continue um, to make progress in that area. My credit score has went up so much. I'm just so proud of myself when it comes to my credit. And then also um, quarter two is just continue to work on my relationship with God um, and that uh, being more consistent because I'm very consistent for a while and then I get inconsistent because I get super busy. Um, so doing that um, is one thing. And then my relationship with my family, um, my husband, we need to go on dates. Like we need date nights, like y'all we need date nights so actually incorporating date nights into the calendar putting it on there making it a thing making it a, a, a thing right where we're just not every now and then we might go on a date night but like actually we got a date schedule for tomorrow because we get so busy that um sometimes it's hard to lose uh 
it's it's hard to stop and smell the roses right um and we have a great relationship and a, a great marriage and you know we have to continue to put that work effort into it so um those are my goals right now of course spend more time with spend time with the kids they're getting older andre's about to be out of the house he's gonna be 18 soon like it's super crazy be with you in a long moment okay Okay, can I get a surf and turf? Are the tenders not as spicy? Mild. Your side item? Uh, let me get red beans and rice. And did you want it with this drink? Yeah, uh, Arnold Palmer. And then can I get a classic number seven with fries and an Arnold Palmer? You said right? Yeah. Oh, I guess this is gonna be our little date today because the kids are all at school and daycare and stuff and we're getting Popeye, so. Um, but yeah, spend more time with the kids. I wanna I used to go on individual dates with the boys and I wanna start doing that again, especially with Andre's last year. Like I want him to remember, you know, the love of his mother before these little girls get in his head. He's got his first like real girlfriend. All they do is text and talk on the phone, FaceTime. Like, they don't, they don't be doing nothing. Um, but, I mean, he's working a lot. Some days I don't even see him. By the time I get home, I'm so tired. I just go to sleep. And then when I get up or he's gone, he's asleep by the time I leave in the morning. So, some days I don't even see my son. So, I want to, like, put on dates for them, too. Dates for Dylan. And then with Tay-Tay, like, she just gets all the love and attention right now. So, she's, like, the easiest one. But she's going to daycare now. She actually does love it she i'll put in some clips where she started to talk more i was uh cleaning up and she was playing with her shoes and she was like shoe shoe and i was like let me record because she's like in here talking um because we've had concerns but now i'm like well maybe she won't qualify for a speech because now her speech is picking up she just needs a little bit more time she just needs a little bit more time celebrating dylan's birthday so we are having a sleep over game night everyone actually has minion uh little uh the little onesies because dylan loves the onesie like he's tall like me like he's pretty big for his age but he's a baby so he loves onesies and stuff like that so um we all have men even my husband we all have minion onesies and yeah i'm super excited so oh 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 my food oh 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 my food Oh, I need to ask for some sweet heat. Hey, can I get some sweet heat? I think that's what it's called. Thank you. You're welcome. Right now, I'm gonna get out of my uniform and show you guys like my self-care evening face routine type of situation ship. The baby's still at daycare. My husband's gonna go get her in probably about an hour. So I'm gonna take a shower and enjoy my time while there's no kids home. I'm telling you, there's nothing like a shower like when the kids are either not here or sleep because it's like no rush. I can shave, I can exfoliate, I can do all the things. 
All right, a little bit about my skincare that I do pretty much on a daily basis. There's nothing really too different about it. I just added like one or two things. You guys can see this is coming in right now. So this is my towel. So uh, when my lady friend is here, I always get a towel. I typically would get them like down here on my chin, but since that gets monopolized by the acne, mass knee, whatever's going on, uh, it, it has kind of shifted, but yeah. So my face is completely smooth, completely like clear, but my towel. I would get it on my nose too, like a huge one right there. So yeah, girlfriend is here. Speaking of girlfriend, I am trying out the Honey Pots uh, pads. I gotta say, I'm, I need to try them for a little bit longer. So today was my first time using it. I, I didn't know they had this cute little flap to open it. So I like opened it here but um they are a little thicker than i like and they are like legit like cotton um so you kind of feel them so when i first put them on i was like mm -mm, no nope don't like it i can feel it i'm not i'm not here for it at all and then after i wore it for like a, a little while i was like okay well maybe sure so i'll continue to give this a try and we'll see how i feel after i'm finished with this pack but skincare. All right, so the Tula, I've been talking about Tula crazy. Don't know them, they don't know me, not sponsored, I wish it was. <laughs> but uh, I love this stuff, like my face loves it. I really get excited about cleansing my face with this. It smells like Dove for the skin, which is crazy because you know how Dove has like that fresh scent, you know you're about to get really, really cleaned and not dried out. That's kind of how this is, love this. Super expensive, this will, probably be the only thing I get from the sale if I get anything from the sale because I need to re-up on it because that's how much I love it. Um, I did add some of the old, no, it looked like Ole, okay? But I, people would be like, Ole, Ole, whatever his name is, Henriksen. Uh, this is the Walnut Scrub. I love this stuff, but it's a little too abrasive for my skin. So I do add it with a gentle uh face wash so i'll do the gentle face wash and then i will add the this on top to kind of give it a little extra scrub but like i told y'all my lady friend was here let me let me handle the situation i'll be right back all right i'm better so for my toner i have been loving the tula get tone pro glycolic uh, resurfacing toner amazing love this stuff so much I have been like venturing and trying the Fenty I've used a good amount but it's not my favorite I can't I can't lie this is I'm not sure if we could do something she said we couldn't do nothing because of COVID we had the birthday board you put it outside our door oh um, so everyone knew it was your birthday in the school huh and on the morning announcements hmm. that's exciting yeah i got school tomorrow mm -hmm. mm -hmm. got any homework for tomorrow why not because it's spring break and, and. 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 spring break spring break spring break spring break all right so my favorite moisturizers guys um i do love this inky list i like this for like when i just want to go real basic uh it's just a really lightweight by dylan lightweight uh, moisturizer my absolute favorite is the belief this is the true cream i do like the aqua bomb as well um at nighttime i do venture into the sunday fridays this is the jet lag mask love this don't love the packaging i don't like anything about their packaging like i really need them to get it out this tin and then um a lot of times at night i do use the caudalie this is venal source it's just a really thick moisturizer as well yes baby yes Maybe we did a, um, mask thing for to beat. Oh, good good job and what is this? Stay, read. Okay, April 13th through 15th. Okay. And it's my oil for tonight. I have the Juno Antioxidant Superfood no, Face no Oil. Why don't we get an A? 
I have a vlog check out the blog <laughs> typically when I make a YouTube video there's a blog associated with it I just go a little bit deeper um so check out the blog it'll be linked down below but I have a blog I I do content you know my husband has a business um so and I have a business oh man looking at hold up hold up tell me what the hold up hold up hold up hold up I'm not used to laying low about my feelings Tell the world I'll write a book when I'm finished I should thank your mama, yeah Look at what she made Sweating you so badly I'm in summer with no rain Yeah, I want it, want it, want it, want it More than I want to I want Y'all catching my interest in this working so effective Got me seeing colors because I couldn't paint You pull me deep and rapture me, leave me no restraint And I should thank your mama Let me cut that down Ooh, child Oh, sis is oily, okay Sis is freaking mad that her makeup is like gone This is why I don't even wear makeup anymore Look at me Papa John's with the come through. I mean, it looks good, but I just, uh, it's either, uh, it's either off my face or oily. Yay. <laughs> so, uh, got my nails done. I love them. I got this color. Mm, it's like 60 something. I don't know. You guys can see. It's like a pinky. It's like a pinky nude. One coat. She was like, one coat <laughs> i was like yes ma'am one coat just for work right because i don't want it to be too i got pink on my nails right i don't want to be too much but i think this is good and i got two coats on my feet but i just got one coat on my actual like hands i got me a brown sugar oh my gosh me trying to be me oh there's a starbucks oh let me go in starbucks right <laughs> had to be old girl first day like had to be her first day in the Publix, which is a grocery store mm, but my lips is still looking good okay anyway had to be her first day she was like how you make this how you make that how you make this and then like they were booming like they were super busy so i got the brown sugar oat milk you know i don't even have high standards for this it's my favorite drink this is like the drink now mm, it's still good but I don't even have high standards because she was just all over the place. Right? Mix, mix it. Mix it up. Right? Ow. Oh. Oh. Oh, my lady parts. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I need to hurry up and get home. I got on these little biodegradable uh, diapers. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, they are for regular days. They are not for heavy days okay um, but anyway uh dylan wants chipotle so i'm about to head to chipotle uh pick up the kids order my husband does not like chipotle i asked him if he wanted something from somewhere else but he didn't respond so <sighs> he don't like chipotle though he's like mm -hmm. mm -hmm. y'all let me go let me stop being distracted because when i tell you that the things that are coming out Got me worried, right? Got me worried. I tried to wear one of these things to bed last night. <laughs> I woke up like, oh, oh, I'm, oh, I'm in a mess. Oh, <laughs> oh, I'm in a mess. My husband was like, "You so silly." I was like, "Oh, babe, I ain't made a mess in like a long time. Like, why did I make a mess last night? These are not for bed." 
and I refuse to buy different sizes for different days like man I'm telling you them always I'm not I'm not ragging on the brand right I love what they're doing I love all they're doing but I don't know that's for me because them always I could wear a regular one and it gets me through the night and I understand that now that my tubes are tied and I'm 100% natural no no birth control no no hormonal stuff going on outside of what my body makes on their own but um yeah I, I needed to I needed to hold all the goodness right all of the shedding of the liner I, I need it I need it all but that's that's neither here nor there let me uh stop talking about my lady bits let me go because they're gonna demonetize me all the way and they petty with that but yeah I'm gonna pick up lunch gotta pack I'm gonna do some editing and stuff we're gonna see what he wants to do for the rest of the day I think I, sh I could be able to be like we're having a party tomorrow so let's just chill today and i might actually be able to like get some editing and stuff done we'll see we'll see how we feel we'll see how we feel but i want to get on the road when we pick up the baby so i want like when we pick her up at like 5 36 i want that to be like getting on the road heading to my friend's house so i'm gonna shoot for that i might even go in the shop and help my husband a little bit because he is swamped he's swamped he's swamped but yeah let me put y'all up here so I, can, I mean, I, that's not to get down because y'all can't see me, but I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta put Chipotle in the GPS. Let me tell y'all. Oh, man, y'all can't see me. Man, the nail salon. Oh, gosh, y'all. The nail salon that I went to is like, where I went to before was like 2 out of 10. Like, I walked in and I was like, mm. They was like, you finna get this basic, basic, basic. Wasn't even good. Grow in a week. Like, didn't like it at all. Like, I was like, I hate this. Never coming here again. Like, as soon as I sat down to this bougie. Okay, it's right next to Publix. When I tell you I walked in and I was like, oh. I didn't film in there, but it's beautiful. It was so nice. And then I had my mask on inside out. So... <laughs> the makeup from earlier was on the outside and I was like damn I just feel bad but they know they understand but man I'm telling you like the lady who did my feet was so nice she even rubbed my foot up against my leg and she was like it's brand new and I was like yes it is <laughs> yes it is ma'am yes it is um and I went up on the pedicure I typically do I got the brown sugar honey one little cocoa butter oh almond milk all that it's like 55 dollars um, but my price wasn't high as high as I thought it was going to be. And then I got a fill-in with the gel. And I was like, <laughs> Grandma was following me. Though. I was like, I got I got your tip. I got it. I went to a little ATM and got her and the other lady who did my nails a tip. Because I love to tip my service workers. But um, she kept following me. <laughs> she did such a good job. But, yeah. Um, what else? That's it. Let me go get this, this boy food. Um, I'll check in with you guys tomorrow, actually, because today the today part is really, uh, is really long. But um, if me and Dylan go and we do like baseball type esque stuff, then I'll film that and there'll be some B roll. But other than that, I will check in with you guys tomorrow. Or yeah, because tomorrow's really the party. Like today is just the day because he had school. You know all the all the things. So tomorrow's actually the party. So I will check with y'all later. But let me go get the, let me go get this Chipotle because Chipotle is life. All of my children love it. I love it. My husband hates it. Mm. But uh, yeah, let me go get this food and get this diaper switch this thing out it's because it has got me worried right now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if you made it this far in the vlog, please make sure that you like and subscribe. Join the internet community. Y'all know other things we do here. We talk about women empowerment. Empowerment, period. You don't have to be a woman. You just got to have goals, right? That's all you got to have. So I love this channel. But Y'all, sometimes, right, I have this best mom ever moment. And that ha, just happened today. So taking a baby girl to school today, I actually passed a baseball academy and I'm just like what well, I have googled so in North Carolina there actually was a place where my husband would take the boys and let them hit um, it was like an hour away but they would go and they would practice and I've googled places like this here and could not find one like could not find one oh hold on they're calling back 
Oh, guys, I'm so excited. So we're going to eat lunch. We're going to go over. So the guy was very nice. It must be like, even though it's a larger building, it seemed like a small business because the number took uh, me right to his cell phone. He was like, hello. And I was like, hello. <laughs> is this is this the place? So he was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> so very, very nice. I tried to use their website. It was a little, a little confusing because there was like no sessions, but to call is better. Um, and we got him a session from 1.30 to 2 to help him with his hitting. I am stoked, guys. I am stoked that he's going to be so excited. He's going to be so, so excited. I'm so excited. And I don't even play baseball. So, guys, that's what we're about to do. I'm about to go in the house. We're about to eat this lunch, this Chipotle. And then I'm going to take him and let him hit for 30, 30 minutes. It's like... 40 bucks like nothing too crazy and actually like honestly you have to invest in your kids if your kids are going to play a sport so i'll probably go ahead and set up some other sessions for him to continue to progress his skills because i just i just want him to be amazing i just want to tap in right and if he actually has some coaches that are willing to help him oh, i'm so excited guys let's go it's a b-roll it's a what bud? what a vibe it's a vibe Get your mask on. We are right on time, so we gotta go. You excited? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Let's see. This is a nice, nice little area. I'll give you guys like a little tour, but let's go inside really quick. Yeah, this place is super nice. So you just walk in, and it's like a big building. <laughs> But they have like bases and, and places for them to hit and coaches and man this is a nice little place i thought it was going to be something different it really is you literally just come in and practice like ain't no frills like you come in and you practice it's super nice and then outside is like a huge like area hi <laughs> um and then I'm gonna just a little parents area where I don't know I don't know we we'll are just protect it so yeah super nice I'm glad I found this I found this only today it's past Tay Tay's daycare but I, had, I was gonna get my nails done so I went past her daycare I turned left and started going back towards the um the house and voila super excited are you excited all right huh? so this is actually coaching so you need to make sure you pay attention and you usually got 30 minutes with the coach 101 okay and you guys are going to do hitting today okay okay i'm going to help you with your stance I'll help you with all of that, okay? Okay. So, we're just waiting right now. You can tell a lot of the kids of the community come here because the kids are, like, really, really good on his team. Some of them. So, hopefully we can, like, get over um, the boundaries that we have right now. Because he has so much power. We just got to tap into it. I know you myself. Huh? You want to tell that I know you myself? Huh? You want to tell them the um, thing I make with myself that I was going to try to make the um, travel team before college? Oh, you can tell them that. Just make sure you pay attention and listen, okay? These are real coaches, so you got to use your time wisely, and they're going to help you with so you can continue to get better, okay? All right. So now we're just waiting for Joe. And I don't know who Joe is, but we just going to wait. <laughs> Stay there. Handle the ball. And then we, because we get here with the handle, and we stay on line. Then follow through. There you go. Nice line drive up the middle. 
Ooh, guys, that was so fun. So one-on-one -on -one is just so much different than like actually the whole team. So the whole team coaching, is he tired? He didn't know he was coming to actually like work, work, right? Uh, the whole- be like with the automatic. You thought it was gonna be- by yourself. Oh. Yeah, you didn't realize you was getting coaching today. Um, but the one-on-one -on -one is so, so good, man. He was teaching the fundamentals. He's an actual coach, so he's like fussing at him when he's putting his arms down and not doing all the things he was supposed to be doing. He's not mm. So, we went ahead and scheduled. He gave you a brief talking to. He gave you a brief talking to. We went ahead and scheduled. You can drink that water. You need to drink something. Um, another session. I'm super excited. I'm so excited. Like. It was just nice to watch because Dylan has so much power, but he doesn't know how to really tap into it. And just this one-on-one -on -one coaching is going to help truly elevate. Because what is, what is your goal, Dylan? Be, um, oh, to um, make it to the um, travel team before college. Before college, the travel team. So in order to do that, you need to be coached and you need to put in that hard work. It was hard, it wasn't easy, right? Not be lazy, because typically he puts his arms down because it's easier, right? So you gotta always like have your arms up, you gotta swing through, you gotta hold onto the ball. All the fundamentals, guys, I loved it. I loved every bit of it, and I was not doing anything. So I would rather come here and get coached properly. And of course you, uh, wait a minute. No, mom, just look at this, it's really important. What? When I swing, uh -huh. it like grinds against my hand. So you got to have your gloves on, but if you don't have your gloves on on time, then you're going to have to do it without your gloves. Yeah, right. Hand. Um... <laughs> that's okay because you because you're doing it properly but your body is going to get used to doing it properly so soon it's going to fit like a glove so i'm glad this place is here loved every minute of it but now my husband is like go get the baby i'm like it's gonna be mad early and why we gotta stay out so that we can get the baby like it's like y'all it's mad early like it's way too early in the day to be going to get the baby it's like two o'clock she not even woke from her nap right now so what is this i think this is something different or maybe they were making their own field i mean it's something but it looks like something i don't know trying to peek i mean this oh is this mini golf they got go -karts. oh it's is this mini golf over there they got go cards go karts oh they got stuff over here what is this i need to go on the website oh look at me let me look see where we're going but yeah so fun better mad all right let's figure out how to get out of here I figure out what we're doing because my husband's pretty much like don't come home without the baby i'm like bro i ain't i ain't trying oh my goodness I ain't trying to be out all this time, but I'm also not trying to like just be doing stuff. Like, what you mean? I'm not gonna pick her up either. She's asleep. Sis is asleep right now. Yeah. So this is how I'm getting Dylan's gifts to my friend's house. Is I'm seeing it. So this is what we got: the switch, little control thing, the switch. My husband got this for him from Vegas. It has they have his name on it. If you know Dylan, you know he loves candy. Game. And then the little carrying case, pooping baby. So I'm actually gonna put Octavia in there. Oh, girl, you stink! Look, she's struggling. You stink! Stink! I'm actually gonna put Octavia Renee's clothes on here, and then the hair stuff, and then we'll be good to go. Ooh. It's a draft. Yeah. Time winds up. I bet it all on us. Yeah.